Hello my friends. Today I will be showing you guys my um, used journal collection. Which is not that big, but um, Amanda asked me if I could make one. And I thought, why not? So, <laughs> here we are. This is my current journal. Um, I'm almost done with it. Just have a couple more pages and... I will be done and ready to start my next journal, which I'm very excited. Um, I have my journals in this little storage thing. I don't know what they're called. So yeah. So let's begin. Let's see. Once again, sorry for the shadow. I'm recording at night because it's the only time I have to make videos. So yeah, sorry. Anyways, this is my first journal that I, the first I started, which is from April 24, 2006 to June 24, 2013. I know. Um, at this time, I wasn't journaling that much. I was, like, I would journal only when I had, like, I guess, important stuff to write about or, I don't know, like, just when I felt like <laughs> writing, I guess. But, yeah. So that's that one. It's like a cloth material. It's really nice. Oh, and at that time I made my friends like write me stuff. <laughs> Let's see. So that's one. There's like writing on the back. And then my next one was this one. Which is really nice as well. So yeah, this is this one. And then I have... This one, which I won't open it that much because it's falling apart. Like, let's see. Like, some of the pages are already like loose, so I'm afraid like of <laughs> opening it and the pages will go all over the place. <laughs> then I have this one. Which has all those quotes in there. Really small, thin journal. So that's that one. Then I have this one. Which I kind of painted myself, <laughs> just so it wouldn't be boring. Because it came with the, how do you call it, like another cover on top that I could like insert new journals on. So I took it out so I could reuse it. sixteen. Time goes by really, really fast. <gasps> super, super fast. This one, which is a composition book, that I just really like the cover, so that's why 
why I used it for journaling. Lots of writing in this one. Another composition book that I had started a long time ago and I just decided I would finish it. <laughs> of writing as well. And let me move this one out of the way. Then I have this one which was my first leather journal which I was very very excited to use and this is probably like my favorite journal. Like one of my favorites because the other favorite is my other favorite is the one I made, of course. So yeah, these are my all-time favorite for right now, I guess. Anyways. But yeah. This is this one. The one I made, which I was really proud of. This was my... Wait. No, this was not my October. I was going to say this is my October journal, but no. Día de los Muertos. So yeah, that's that one. Such a great journal, of course, because I made it. <laughs> Just kidding. But yeah. Then, this is my October journal. Which got super, super fat to close up. Like... Look how tight it is. <laughs> but I did it. I was able to close it. <laughs> Birdie. I don't know how I did it. I had to like push everything. But yeah, this is my October one. So it's all Halloween stuff. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed <laughs> watching my small collection. Um, subscribe if you want to see more. Oh, by the way, there's a flip through for every single one of these journals. So if you haven't seen one of them that you're interested in, you can find them in my channel. So yeah, and... I'm almost done with this one, so I will be doing the final part pretty soon as well. And comment down below which of these journals, uh, journal flip throughs, was your favorite. Like, let me know. Like, if you if you've seen like all of the flip throughs, like which one was your favorite that you enjoy the most. Alrighty, guys. Well, <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.